In this video, we'll uncover the benefits of infrared heat therapy. Hi ladies and gentlemen, I'm Dr. Zorowski and welcome back to the channel. And if you're new to the channel, as always, it's a pleasure to have you here. Be sure to subscribe, hit that bell notification, and join our notification community so I can help you excel your health and your life. In this video, we're talking about infrared heat therapy. This is a really you know, favorite topic of mine because first of all, I use it for my own personal use and I also use it clinically in order to help patients get better results. You know, as a matter of fact, when we look at infrared heat therapy, there's some people, or I should say some doctors out there who have said that it's one of the most powerful tools that they have besides following a good healthy diet. And so it's a very powerful tool that you can utilize in order to, you know, improve your health and also even reverse some different health problems that you're having. So what we're going to do in this video is talk about all the benefits that infrared heat has to offer and then talk about what you need to look for if you're going to utilize infrared heat yourself and then some of my favorite ways to use it. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Now I will say that when it comes to this time of year, especially because I live in a cold climate, I really love using the infrared sauna because because it just warms you up, it feels great, it helps reduce pain and, and discomfort, especially after you know heavy workouts. And so let's go ahead and talk about all the different ways that you can benefit from infrared heat. First here is anti-aging. Now when we look at infrared heat, basically what has been found in some of the studies is that it's going to improve your collagen levels, your elastin levels, it also is going to reduce wrinkles and you know make your skin more firm. So as a result, it's going to give you a more youthful look and it's going to support that anti-aging process. The next one here is detoxification. So the reason it's going to support detoxification is because the infrared heat actually gets deep into the tissues. It's going to get deep into the muscle tissue, the fat, and as a result, it's going to start releasing some of those different toxins, but it also is going to cause you to sweat if you're using an infrared sauna. As a result of that, you're going to sweat out some of those toxins, and then when you look at detoxification, some of the detox that I talk about combined with infrared saunas, it's very powerful. It's a very powerful combination for total body detox. The next is weight loss. You know, when you use infrared heat, infrared sauna, essentially you're going to go in, you're going to start sweating, your heart rate's going to increase, it's going to burn calories. And so it's really powerful for that too. And there's a lot of people who report that they've changed nothing in their lifestyle. They just, you know, added in using an infrared sauna. And as a result, they started losing weight. Now, the next here is it's going to improve your heart health, your cardiovascular health. There's studies out there that show that it's going to decrease and normalize blood pressure, normalize cholesterol, and even help in the healing process of different heart conditions out there. So you want to make sure that if you want to really get those benefits, the you know heart health benefits, we're using some infrared heat therapy in order to get those. It's also going to reduce pain. You know, there's studies out there that show it helps reduce arthritic pain. Um, pain from ankylosing spondylitis was another study I came across. But you know, there's so many different reports of people finding that infrared heat just kind of reduces pain across the board, whether it's from an injury, you know, recovering, whether it's from, um, you know, symptoms of diabetes. There's just so many different things out there that people have reported that it's helped with in the way of pain. Now, the next thing is it's going to improve your overall quality of life. You know, there's a study done in Japan and it found that people who are using infrared heat therapy, as a result of using it, they just had a more positive outlook, a more positive mental state, and also just an overall improved sense of well-being. And so, you know what, if you're doing it for nothing else just to feel better, then that's good enough. And then last on our list here is it's going to support recovery. So if you're weight training, if you're doing endurance training, if you're recovering from an injury, it supports that whole process. And there's even a lot of athletes that will actually go and use infrared heat therapy in order to get better results, train harder, faster, and, and just, you know, be able to get the results that they're looking for. Now, when we look at this infrared heat therapy, I'm talking about some of the different benefits here that are found in the research but if you just you know go online and look at all the different benefits that people have from it, it goes far beyond this list here. Now, the next thing I want to talk about here is what you want to look for when you're getting an infrared heat unit, okay? So there's near, mid, and far infrared, and each one of them offer their own unique benefit. But when you're getting a infrared unit of any sort, whether it's a heating pad or a sauna, you want to make sure that you get full spectrum infrared. And essentially what that means is it's going to have near, mid, and far and offer you the benefits of all of them. And so when you're looking at anything infrared heat, always get full 
full spectrum. Now, the other thing I want to talk about is how I like to use infrared heat. So first of all, in the way of heating pads, I already mentioned that clinically we use the heating pads. You can put them up on your shoulders and neck. You can put them on a knee. You can put them on your low back, whatever it is. And they just feel really great and they help reduce inflammation, reduce that pain and really make you feel a lot better. The other thing that's great about the heating pads is you can get them for a pretty inexpensive price. You can get them in full spectrum and it's a good way to get into infrared heat and start getting some of those different benefits it has to offer. The next favorite way that I have is using a portable sauna. So there's these little mini portable saunas. They look kind of funny. They're almost like a tent with your head popping out of them. And the good thing is, is that first of all, you get the benefit of a full size sauna. They feel great, but you're going to go in them. You're going to get a good sweat going. And you know, one of the better things about them is that they're small. If you have a condo, an apartment, or just, you know, you have a house that you don't want to have this big, huge sauna in, they're great because they're small and you can even fold them up and put them away. And so I've used a portable sauna for many years. I really love them. And then of course, this full size sauna is always great too. Some people just love the full size because they can go in, they can even do some exercise in it. They can do yoga in it. They can do kettlebell workouts. They can, you know, sit in there with their friends and family. And so it's really, you know, whatever fits you best. And so, you know, obviously with a full size sauna, you're going to have to open your wallet up a little bit more for that one. Now, the other thing that you can do is a lot of spas will even have memberships where you can go and get a membership just to simply use the infrared sauna because so many people are using it as a result of finding out that it offers a lot of um, really positive health benefits. And so once again, these are the benefits. Make sure that you're getting full spectrum, utilize some infrared heat for best health results. And other than that, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and and if you have any questions, post them in the comments section below. Subscribe to the channel right here and then check out my other videos on how you can improve your health. I'll see you in the next video.